Welcome ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to determine all the missing um, angles in these two triangles. Uh, so to do that, I'm going to use the triangle angle sum theorem. And where we know that the measure of all the angles in a triangle adds up to 180. So I look at my two triangles and I say, all right, here has two missing angles. And here I only have one missing angle. So I know I can use the triangle sum theorem to find the measure of angle 1. So I'll say 70, I'll say. Measure of angle 1 plus 75 degrees plus 35 degrees equals 180. Combine these two. Measure of angle 1 equals um, 110. Ah, oh, jeez, I keep on doing that. Measure of angle 1 plus 110 degrees equals 180 degrees. Solve for measure of angle 1. And I see measure of angle 1 equals 70 degrees. Cool, right? I got 70 degrees. Measure of angle 1 is equal to 70 degrees. So now I'm going to replace that with 70 degrees. Now, there's a couple angle relationships I can use in addition to my angle sum theorem. Remember, when you have intersecting lines, you have angle relationships. One, you can see that I have vertical angles, right? Angles that share a vertex but do not share sides. So measure of angle 3 is going to be 30 degrees. And then also remember, from angle relationships, um, a couple things, that these create a linear pair, right? So we can say that 70 degrees plus the measure of angle 2 equals 180 degrees. Therefore, solving for 70 degrees, measure of angle 2 equals 110 degrees. OK? So now, lastly, all we need to do is figure out what angle 4 is. And again, I can go back to using my angle sum theorem saying that measure of angle 4 plus um, 70 degrees plus 28 degrees equals 180 degrees. So measure of angle 4, I combine these, um, plus 98 degrees equals 180 degrees. Subtract 98 degrees, subtract 98 degrees. Measure of angle 4 is going to equal um, 72. No, 82. No, that'd be 90. 90, 82. Good. Got it. I'm OK. Sorry. Um, equals 82 degrees. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you determine the missing angles of triangles.